that I'm afraid But I don't break I heard you question my stability You think I'll fall just like a guillotine But I am here to stay Won't look away Storm is coming So you better start running No, you can't control the I'm coming for the coming for the I'm coming for the throne Um, what time you woke up this morning and um, what the schedule for the day is going to look like as best as you know. Um, I woke up at 4.30 this morning and today we're going to do first round and quarterfinals and then two rounds of consolation. Sweet. And then we'll stop and class D will start. Nice. What you like better about this setup so far? Uh, I don't feel so claustrophobic, <laughs> and we get some space away from all the other teams, and uh, way more mats to warm up on. Sweet. Um, what are you excited for today, Keith? Uh, to weigh in <laughs> <laughs> and wrestle. Go. Cool. <laughs> to weigh in and wrestle. <laughs> Man of many words. Alright, so here we are finally at the state tournament and we're at the Catholic Health Initiative. Uh, CHI Catholic Health. You know, that's actually a great CHI question. CHI Health <laughs> Arena. TD, isn't it TD Ameritrade now? Um, or no, 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 it is CHI. CHI yeah. It is CHI, you're right. Um, so anyway, really happy to be at this point. It was a big mystery as to whether or not, you know, we would able to be able to finish out a whole season with all COVID, and, but um, we're here. And so kind of modified, a little bit different than the way it used to be. Um, really to start it off, we're just doing class A to start. Normally we'd be paired up with class D and be running um, for the first couple of sessions and then they would combine everything up. But everything's gotta be a little bit more spaced out. So they're just doing one class at a time to start. So. We're just gonna be going on six mats today and then just kind of running through a couple of the rounds um, and then finishing it out tomorrow. So it's just a little bit of a different setup. It's not gonna be as packed in the arena. It's not gonna be um, as many teams going at the same time, but you know, still hopefully gonna be a really electric atmosphere and something that the guys are gonna be excited to compete in. Sweet.
Jurgens, how many times have I spilled my coffee? Every single time. Out of a hundred times, how many times have I spilled my coffee? One hundred. Do you think you've been to a hundred uh, meets in your high school career, though? Hundred tournaments? Probably. How many tournaments? How many? No. Yeah, not no. Well. Weekends. Competitions. <laughs> no. No. Hey. Hey. <laughs> I'll do you, and you do me. Coach Rowe, why do you have a cord hanging out of your pocket? Um, I have a phone that does not hold any charge, therefore I walk around today with... Wow, that's an easy takedown uh, right there. Super easy takedown. <laughs> uh, one of these, which is not, it looks like a phone, but it's not. It's a portable charger. So I'm portably charging my self cellular device in preparation for the day. Give us a story really quickly of getting the state packet two nights ago on, on the way up to Omaha. Coach McCurdy and I decide to come up the night before to relieve some stress of the first day of state. And we take his truck from 1970. It's got rust <laughs> all over it. Um, I was a little iffy about it, but we get on the interstate, um, and he tells me that the throttle is stuck, <laughs> and uh, so he's braking, and uh, the, the cruise control was not turning off, so we get to the exit for the CHI center, and still a problem, so he throws it into neutral, turns the car off, we coast off the exit, down, turns a corner and gets into a parking lot. I would, I don't like giving McCurdy much, much of uh, credit, but very well, very good piece of driving. Uh, I was of course. Fearful for my life, turns off the car, turns the car back on and goes, <laughs> revs up back up to 80. <laughs> yeah, in park. Oh and so he turns it off again. <laughs> And we're researching about it, what the heck we're gonna do. I'm about to just run to the center to go get the tickets. 
and <laughs> then we hear a little boom. We were on a ledge. You thought the, yeah. you oh, thought yeah, yeah. The, you thought the car was going to drive off a ledge. 80 miles per hour. <laughs> we're in park. <laughs> <laughs> and so there's a ledge right here. So I was about to open up the door and like get out real fast and let McCurry take the, take it, take one for the team. <laughs> take one for the team. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it got unstuck and we live to see another day. That's the story of state packets. Yeah. 2021. Well, no, that was too uh, one of the things that I kind of talked to Keith a little bit about is this idea of visualization. Everyone that's wrestling tomorrow has been at, out there. You've seen the arena. You've seen the mats that you're going to comp be competing on. Um, sometimes it just takes some confidence to understand, like, my moves can work, right? And sometimes we're, we're I feel like today we're a little hesitant on not getting to our go-to attacks. And part of that is just, you know, being nervous because it's the state tournament. But at this point, you've felt it now. Now I want you to go kind of and rest this evening and just kind of visualize your attacks working against your opponents. Put yourself out there. Think about the, t the takedowns that you're going to uh, to score on. And, you know, put yourself in uncomfortable positions. You're up by one. There's 20 seconds left. You've got to ride gritty. This guy's a savage on bottom. And you've got to lift and return. And you've got to do all these things where, you know, you got to you got to do a gut check. Right. So start kind of putting yourself in that place and, and, and again, allow the pressure to relieve off your shoulders by just focusing on what you can control. Let the uncontrollables roll off your shoulders, out of your mind, and uh, let's put forth great effort tomorrow and keep, continue to put this ball in the roll, or rolling this ball uh, in the direction that we want it to be headed. All right? We've got a great day ahead of us. Bring it in. Love you, boys. Spartans on three. One, two, three. Spartans. Spartans. Coach Rutt, first day at State. How'd it go? Give us the highlights. Give us uh, team's performance. Oh, boy. Um, overall, I think we wrestled really well. Uh, we still have five guys on the front side. Five guys are guaranteed a state medal, and uh, we'll be wrestling in the state semifinals tomorrow morning. Uh, and then we've got one guy on the back side, Aiden Ingwersen, will be uh, in the heartbreak round to, to see if he can become a state medalist. Um, you know, and then we've got uh, three guys that are disappointed, uh, and that's just the, the highs and lows of wrestling or, or what makes it great, right? You've got some guys that had uh, some really, really big wins, and then we've had some guys that are really disappointed. So, um, overall, I thought, you know, the effort was there, or we just uh, lost some positions, and, um, you know, it's the best the best competition, and, and um, you know, you're going to win some, and you're going to lose lose some uh, and uh, it's about you know what you learn in the process uh, I just could not be more thankful of the opportunity uh, in the COVID year to be able to come out here and to compete in the state term I think a lot of people would have guessed that we wouldn't be here doing what we did today so super super thankful for that um, yeah Amen. Oh. happy birthday Keith Smith let's go